What's up guys? Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to control your lightsabers using the force. Many of us are on different levels of learning the ways of the force. And how I got my lightsaber to turn on without touching it is actually a really cool feature from this Ahsoka lightsaber, but really any lightsaber with the version 3 Xeno board in it. So this has the Xeno V3 board in it and with that you can get this app called the Xeno Configurator, right? So what you want to do is download Xeno Configurator and then you open the app connected and it's going to connect your lightsaber and as you can see here on the top I have it named you can rename your lightsabers also but I have it named uh, for this lightsaber here and uh, you can just press the power button here and this has so many very visually aiding uh, features because you can adjust the volume here as you can see to like 54 percent just a lot of visual aid here instead of like trying to hold down the button and this light this uh specific lightsaber doesn't have like a light by the button so that you can tell how many times it flashes so you actually have to count and then keep track of counting to select different modes colors and uh, a lot of times I personally get lost in that because I'll hold the button down too long or something and then it'll do something else that I don't want it to do. So this app helps me, uh, for example, like let's say you want to change your font, right? And instead of like powering the lightsaber off and then like twisting it or something to go through your sound fonts, you can actually just go through your sound fonts in the app here and it'll change. And you can just go over to the second one and it'll change. This is a very, very helpful app and that's what I love about the Xeno V3 lightsabers. And it's not just specific to this lightsaber. Uh, any, any lightsaber with the Xeno V3 board in it uh, will work with this app, okay? So I'm not gonna go through them all. Um, I'll let you guys. I'll let you guys have fun going through these. This one's my favorite one, um, but I'll let you guys have fun going through these fonts for yourselves. So I won't like spoil any of the surprises. Okay, there's 34 fonts in this lightsaber. Um, so yeah, I'm not gonna go through them all. I just wanted to show you guys this app quick, and it's got so many different like customizations, as you can see here. I'm not going to go through all the features. Uh, I'll just let you guys mess with it yourselves. Um, you know, you can change your motor speed even to make it really sensitive, like... I like it at 50. And another really cool thing also is that you can actually control your other lightsaber. Same thing on this one, you can change the fonts. And if you want to go back to this one, you just connect to this lightsaber. Yeah, this app is just a really helpful tool to uh, give you just way more accessibility options. And you can just close the app whenever you're done. And that's it, it's that simple. So hopefully, uh, this video was informative to you guys. I know I just went through it briefly, so if you have any questions, just leave them in the comment section down below, and I'll be sure to answer them as soon as I can. Yeah, let me know uh, if you guys download this app and how you guys are doing with the app. It's super helpful, and it's just made things a lot easier for me uh, using this lightsaber instead of sitting there trying to figure out everything to do, or you know, just sitting trying to figure out all the things to learn with it, like. Like you can see here, if I twist it a certain way, the count. See, you would have to go through all the fonts like this. Codex of light. And then you can't see what you selected, so that app is like really helpful for that. So, yeah. Okay, I will let you guys go. Have fun out there, okay? Star Wars is for everyone. I'll see you soon.
<laughs> Hopefully I got that all. 